Allman's Nicholas Patrick. He is a tremendous tennis player, and now he's just earned another amazing honor. Boys Tennis Player of the Year Award given by USA Today. Nick Cousin takes us inside the hard work it took for Patrick to gain that recognition. One thing I think that was really noticeable is that he had a real passion for the game. So we always knew that something, something special was going to come of Nicholas. Nicholas Patrick has that dog in him. Two years playing high school tennis at Alleman and a two-time state champion. Just a motivating factor. I think I try to compete to the best of my abilities, uh, both on and off the court. I see myself as a pretty competitive person. So just trying to be the absolute best at everything I do, no matter what that is. Just doing everything to the 100%, you know, like everything as hard as I can. Just trying to be the best version of myself, trying to stay disciplined, and like I said, just kind of be the best model of me. So whether that means in the classroom, on the tennis court, in the gym, just trying to be the best version of myself. Those two titles helped Patrick gain national recognition. Boys Tennis Player of the Year is Nicholas Patrick, a sophomore from Almond Catholic High School in Illinois. USA Today named Patrick the National Boys Tennis Player of the Year after dropping just one set and going undefeated all season. He really embraces the journey and learning and uh, always trying to improve. So it's uh, tennis is a journey. So uh, uh, and, he, and I think he really enjoys it. The journey has taken Patrick to places like North Carolina and Florida to play against top pros and college athletes. It was a really great experience overall and something that I'm going to remember through my next couple years of high school going into this process. But yeah, just hitting with anybody I can. I have some fantastic mentors and adults in the area that are around here that have helped me out tremendously. Have become kind of big brother or father figures to me also that have just helped me out tremendously. So working with them and working with juniors in the area and working with just really anybody who, who's able to hit and just finding a way to get a little bit better every single day. As long as Patrick continues to feel the support from those around him, he knows he can achieve even more greatness ahead. I feel like I have this whole Quad City community, uh, all the Alderman community, my family, all these people that kind of have my back. So like I said, it doesn't really feel like I'm all alone on the court. I feel like I have everybody's kind of, you know, best wishes out there because they've been just so supportive and I couldn't, I know I say that so much, but I couldn't be more grateful for how much support I've received and everybody's been just so phenomenal. So it really does help me when I am getting those the coaching or in the tough times maybe just to know that everybody believes in me and it gives me a little like, kind of self-belief in myself if maybe I'm struggling a little bit. The dream is to play professional tennis and you know, be the best, absolute best tennis player I can be. Uh, play grand slams, I have very high goals, but it's just I want to work hard every day to achieve those. And I think college tennis is something that I've dreamed about ever since I was a little boy. So just, just really excited for this whole process to turn out and just kind of trust that it's all going to kind of fall into place. Patrick heads to Kalamazoo, Michigan next for the National Hard Courts Tournament before going back to school. Reporting for Local 4 Sports, I'm Nick Cousin. Thank you, Nick and Nicholas. Some talent indeed.